Your Excellency, Luis Lula da Silva, the President of the Federative Republic of Brazil, other world leaders here present, Your Excellency's Head of State and Government, it is an honor to address this gathering of the 20 leaders for me taking place in this beautiful and historic city of Rio. Let me, at the onset, express gratitude to the government of Brazil for extending the invitation to us, and to me in particular, as Nigeria, and to highlight the problem of poverty and hunger. The, food, the session devoted to fight, fighting poverty and hunger. I am from Nigeria. It's better to give you the true picture of what's going on in Africa. We have terrorism challenges, insecurity challenges that are preventing farmers to even go to their farm. We have problems in Sudan, displacing people. We have problems of climate change, flooding, destroying crops. And we have problem of protectionism. We have problems. It is very important to make it clear and louder here. We have problem of out of school children. We have problem of funding free education or giving our children one meal a day in a classroom to even make them pay attention to schooling. Africa has that problem. And the problem is compounded by some other conflicts around the world. The war in Ukraine and others. The war on Gaza Strip. That's Poverty-driven problems. What do I do to help the small-scale industry? The cost of funding is expensive. What do I do to get power to industrialize my country? The cost of funding is extremely expensive. The developed world need to extend these promises that you have out here today. I must salute every one of you. But support the continent. The neglect of Africa is a danger to the rest of humanity. And we have to lift one another up. We have to build an inclusive economy that takes into account the population growth. In Nigeria, I have over 250 million souls. The fight against hunger and poverty is not a matter of choice, but a matter of priority for me. But where do I get those apps? I have a very vibrant youth population, 70% below the age of 30, in, in schools, set up funding for their education. It's a challenge. And I even if I have the phone, how do I turn it around? 
Reform, yes, I must. And I've embarked upon that aggressively. But as I go through that reform, I must equally that see that the other hand, the hunger and poverty is resisting to all of us here. Investment in education, investment in health, in investment in food security. Cheaper financing, the risk in various African countries, putting us on a better and more progressive arrangement to prioritize food security and the agricultural reforms are necessary. We need to take action now and quickly. I'm glad Brazil has brought the question of hunger and poverty to the forefront. Why, wish you a very successful deliberation. We signed off for the contract, and I support all the efforts to eradicate hunger and poverty. I must state again that Africa. Africa is crying for support. Thank you very much for listening.